season, we have the happiest customers in wireless. This portion of Fox 23 News is brought to you by Midwest Sporting Goods, your team sports headquarters. Welcome back. Esophageal cancer is one of the rarest cancers in our country. But there is one form that is on the rise. Almost 17,000 new cases will be diagnosed this year. And joining us this morning, Dr. Jack from the Cancer Treatment Centers of America. He's here to tell us more about this disease. And first off, Dr. Jack, what are some of the symptoms that people need to look for? Well, something that can happen is the chronic reflux symptoms, the heartburn, chest pain, difficulty swallowing. Mm -hmm. It's not unusual because when you look at the esophagus, it's that tube that connects the mouth to the stomach. So the tube is right in this area, and over time, if that reflux happens op over and over, then it can erode some of the things that can take place in the esophagus itself. If you take a look at the small surface right over here, mm -hmm. let's magnify that several hundred times. And when you look at what happens, this is what happens to the esophagus over time when that chronic acid takes place Oh, over and wow. over. You can see what happens here. It just eats it holes. It just eats holes into that, that area itself. And you can see that over time, that can lead to the formation of very, very uh, uh, destroyed cells. The mm -hmm. ones that are destroyed normally uh, w uh, from the acid uh, are the ones that will eventually transform into something like this, a tumor. Okay, okay. so the green cells destroyed and what's left in there are the red cells. Right. And these tumors. red cells are the ones that survive. And this is a condition called Barrett's esophagus? Barrett's esophagus. I've actually heard of that. I, you know, it seems like it's more common for people to be diagnosed with that. Mm -hmm. And that's what happens after years and years of reflux. Years and years of reflux. You can see all those surfaces become eaten away, leaving behind only the ones that survive. And the ones that survive are the cells that are malignant. Okay, so it's a precancerous condition, mm -hmm. and um, so then what new treatments are available for people who have? Well, there is a treatment uh, available. Typically, radiation and chemotherapy can be used, but when the disease is advanced, when they cannot treat this anymore, there's a special therapy called photodynamic therapy, which is available at Mayo Clinic and locally at Cancer Treatment Centers of America. Essentially, what happens is a medicine is injected into your bloodstream, and the, that medicine makes those tumors very sensitive to light. If we take these small tumors and we amplify them several hundred times. Okay, so those are the tumors, and then this is like the laser this that is a laser beam goes down your throat, years. obviously right. not that big. Obviously not this big. And you've been given medicine in your bloodstream. Yes, and then we're going to apply that laser beam to these tumors themselves. Oh. And you can see <laughs> that the laser beam actually makes it, these tumors destroy wow. themselves. Wow. Yeah. That's huh. amazing. Yeah. How long has this treatment been around? It's been around for many years. It's been experimental. Uh -huh. But uh, places like Mayo Clinic and MD Anderson also use it, and it's locally available here at Cancer Treatment Centers of America. And have they had a lot of success with it so it far? It is very helpful for those patients who cannot swallow. Hmm. Well, wow. because that's what eventually happens as the disease progresses. Yes. And why do you think Barrett's um, esophagus, why is that condition on the rise? Why are more people? We're seeing a rise because of the chronic reflux that takes place. When you lay down at night, that esophagus uh, becomes exposed over and over chronically to that acid condition, leading to the formation of this type of cancer, the adenocarcinoma of the esophagus. Hmm. Well, thank you so much for coming in and bringing interesting props, as you always do. <laughs> to help explain it to us. We appreciate it. Cancer Thank Treatment you. Centers of America has a special offer for you, our Fox 23 viewers, a free subscription to the quarterly magazine, Cancer Fighters Thrive. If you would like this free subscription, just go to fox23.com and click on the Fox box.